What's up and welcome back to my channel. So for today I'm coming at you bare face, not because I'm doing a makeup tutorial, I want to do that eventually, but I'm coming at you bare face because I just can and that's okay with me. <laughs> but I am doing a room tour for you guys, a fall edition room tour. I This was highly requested, um, people just really wanted to see it and I thought I'm going to show you my room. And honestly everything I got is probably from either Marshalls, Walmart, or the good old Dollar General. I have decorated my room for fall and it makes me so happy. So cozy. It smells like pumpkin spice in here. It smells like maple donuts and I love it. So without further ado, let's just get into the video. <laughs> Okay, so when you walk in the door, you'll see this cute little painting. I, not really painting, dry erase board coloring thing I did on the dry erase board. And you come over here and you'll see my key hook. I found this thing at the Dollar General, this at Walmart. And this is an ornament I need to finish. <laughs> and then you'll walk in and this is what you'll see. This is my nightstand. I just have a crate full of books, devotionals, and my sleep mask, and just kind of everyday night essentials. I have um, just a pillow spray. It's a lavender and vanilla spray, and I just have some chapsticks and some essential oils and some lotion. So this is my bedding and I had just got this little pillow from Walmart last year and this throw from Dollar General last year. I think this is pretty well how I did my bedding last year. Um, so it hasn't changed much. Um, and if you look over here, you'll see my bookshelf. I think bookshelves are very cozy, especially in the fall time. So I just love the immediate cozy feel. Um, this is a painting that I did. And I'm pretty proud of it, so I went ahead and hung it up. I did this while we were camping. And it really makes me happy just to look at because I didn't fail. <laughs> so this is my Bible study crates, actually. And I have different Bible studies in it. My Bibles, my binders, things like that. Little pencils, highlighters, markers. Um, and then I have this little pumpkin. Me and my friend and my sister did a DIY pumpkin. And we just took succulents and we took little pumpkins and just a bunch of different sprigs and punched them all into a styrofoam pumpkin. And look how cute it is. We love it. Over here is my dresser with my TV on it. So um, I just kind of made it look all cozy and cute this Walmart is getting some adorable things so I got this from Walmart for like five dollars I think this is a Dollar General candle guys Dollar General and Walmart has really stepped up their game they have adorable stuff for really cheap so um, yeah if you're looking for some fall essentials fall adorable house things that's where you need to go lantern I actually got it it's a hearth and home um, lantern but I got it from Gabe's for I think like four dollars which was like a steal so I put some fairy lights in it and some little sprigs some roses and some pine cones and a little pumpkin and I love it the fairy lights came from the Dollar General and they work really good guys like I've had the batteries in it for a year now and they work great just have my little Scentsy burner and my TV come over here you'll see my vanity I have a little chandelier light some succulents and then I just have a shelf with some things on it um, just make it brushes just daily essential things and um, I was actually gonna paint this wooden slab 
I thought it looked really cute with the candle and all these decorations on it. Hey guys. So I just decorated it for this and maybe eventually I'll do a craft with it. I don't know. I just really like the way it looks. I got this little vase at Dollar General for I think three, anywhere from three to five dollars, which was a steal. And um, these are just some styrofoam pumpkins, 97 cents. These candles come from the Dollar General. They smell amazing and they're $5 and they're huge like Yankee Candle candles. But Yankee Candle is almost like $20. Like they're very expensive candles. These are $5 and I don't feel bad for burning them. So, <laughs> and they smell delicious. So if anybody's looking for cheap candles um, that they actually want to burn and that smell good, you need to go to the dollar store, just saying. Um, then I just have some Germexes and a little pumpkin here, my little letter board. I love this because it reminds me of Scrabble and it's fall and I don't know, I just really like it. Here's my tall mirror. I just have um, some jewelry in it and um, it spins around so I decorated it with just a few different things, some candles, picture frame, things like that and I have a rolly cart here. And actually, my dad built me one of these little inserted slabs just to put on the top of that cart. Um, they actually now make those at Walmart if you have a three-tier cart and you want something like that. It comes in handy a lot. It's extra desk space for me. Um, so I can put my laptop there. And then over here is my desk. I got the desk and the chair. It's a rolling little white chair from Walmart. I love them. This um, chair is actually padded really comfy which kind of surprised me I love it I needed something comfy to sit in all day so got that um, I just have just some little trinkets a pencil holder there is a Bath and Body Works candle I don't like that one though because <laughs> I, I just don't I'm the type of person that wants them to last for a very long time so there's that I open the lid every morning <laughs> and I just have some little picture frames a little bulletin board um, and my diploma and just a few just important like special documents to me and then I just have a filing cabinet down there these crates I found them at the Dollar Tree and I painted them and they work perfect for just um, random things that everybody has in their desk so um, there's that over on this side is just my closet I really don't want to open my closet because you know we all have closet issues so that's my closet issue <laughs> and we just have some shaggy curtains to cover that so i hope you guys enjoyed that room tour if you did give it a big old thumbs up and comment down below if you have any other questions about items below um i can always try my best to link things and i can try to like refer you to the right direction i don't know if i'll remember where all these things were because a lot of these were things I've just collected in time just keeping a storage tote for every year um, but anyways smash the subscribe button and I will see you guys next time in another video